Oh wait, shit, I forgot the most important thing, sorry. So what weird armor? Am I wearing like medium armor? Yeah, that's why my cat stuff isn't working. Where's my robes? What's my ornate to gloves? I don't have... Do I not have gloves to go with this? I swear I did. Hunting gloves. Maybe I didn't. Oh, maybe I didn't. Maybe it was just the robe. And the boots. Or whatever it was. Oh yeah, maybe I don't have legs and boots to go with it. Wait, legs and gloves, that's what I'm missing. Okay. I'll do. Damn it. Secret passage. Where is it? It's gonna be like. Why is this something that I can. Why is this going? Oh, it's just something else I haven't looted. We've looted enough. We've had enough. Guessing it's this. <sighs> Air seeping through the cracks. Passage must be here. How do I open it? Okay. Guessing we open it on the other side or something. Of course, this is more lootable. Oh my goodness. That's lootable, but I can't loot it. I stuck. I stuck. We good. We good. It's gonna be like some dumb lever or something, right? All right. I have a feeling like. Something around here. Aha! There we go. Nick of time. Now to get out of here. Nick of time after I just like <laughs> loot everything. Oh yeah, Nick of time, mate. It doesn't seem like we've been very far. We can't be that far away, surely. Ah! Use the lever. Thank you. Maybe we'll get to Reginald's joke when we're out. Well, don't mind me, I'm just in your house. Do -do 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 -do. Casual roll. All right, so that's uh, that's favor number two done. We've now got Maximilian Basodi's house. So it looks like we just got to go back to Olgier, I guess. Quickly check. Straight ahead. Mutant. Bank robber, actually, but you know. Spreads disease, defeatism, and desertion. Oh, I want to use that new sword we got, it looks pretty cool. Need to get next level there. Isn't he like. Yeah, he's up here, isn't he? Oh no. Is he at the. Oh, yeah, where is Olgiad right now? Oh, he's. Oh, yeah, he's in the pub here, isn't he? Whoops, totally forgot that. About to go back to the uh, Garen estate. Well, yeah. they burnt that down, though, so. Would have been tough. Oh. 
fuck? What are you looking at? <laughs> How much for a herring? Crown a piece. Huh? I'll wait for it to drop. Line. Need to chat. I'm all ears with you. Tell me, how'd you meet the Ophiri you turned into a beast? Aren't you a nosy one? What's it matter? You like to talk about yourself. That I cannot deny. Ophiri Why is it deleted YouTube videos? Oh, they're on my new channel. Exclamation mark channel to get a link to it. To learn of their cultures and customs. He fell for her last. As it happened, this woman was already important to me. But at the time, I was now compared to a noble from a foreign land. So her parents promised her hand to the Afiri, though she loved me. If you'd only seen his feeble attempts at charm. When she asked why he travelled disguised as a common merchant, he said he was like the frog from the fairy tale. One kiss from her, and he turned into a prince. Wanted to be a frog. Became a frog. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oi, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. Oh, that's better. All right. What do you have for me? Max Persodi's house, as requested. This all? Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No? He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others, too. Stones you've got. But well, I didn't think he'd have the stomach for a massacre. Yeah, badass uh, girl. Let's go. I think I might find the stomach for another once your final wish is fulfilled. <laughs> you really don't like me, do you? Hate smartasses. Hate it when they try to use me. It's why both brothers are dead, and why you should tread carefully. Noted. Now I have some advice for you. The Borsodis aren't worth your tears. Sons of bitches to a man. Horst's brother. Did you know about him? I should think so. Ewald was famous in certain circles. Which ones? The kind noble witches don't usually associate with. He murdered for coin, no questions. Without batting an eye. Always extravagantly, though. If not for his damn surname, I believe I'd have invited him to join the company. Why did you need those papers? To sink the Borsodis, naturally. You see, I learned of an interesting clause in old man Maximilian's will. It states that his sons must meet and shake hands in agreement at least once a year at Bellate. Failing that, the auction house must be auctioned off. The proceeds to go to Bill Marius Hospital. Guess the old man sensed what might happen. Horst and Ewell are gnawing on soil now. But thanks to these papers, their relatives won't get the auction house. Families lost it for good. And the hospital hmm. will have the funds it needs good to guy, treat orphans yes. and beggars pro bono. Awfully noble of you, showing so much concern for the needy. I couldn't give a rat's ass about the needy. May they wither and disappear along with the city. I wanted one thing. Revenge. The Borsodis. What's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse, they evicted me from a home. Are you really interested? Yeah, go on. Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> cheeky as ever. Cheeky, cheeky. My family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop one year. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. 
I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh, it was like talking to a wall. I went to the auction, saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword, my mother's death mask, my brother's horse tack. Ah, horse earned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was but the start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune, and our betrothal was no more. They found her another suitor, one from beyond the sea. The anger I felt, I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern, drank around, a second, a broad, then had another tankard. And then, then, I asked the wrong bloke for help. Olgion's a great character. What happened then? Ah, what happened then, Witcher, was one big stinking pile of shite. Well, why do you stand there? Do you need something still? I think one of the great things about the Witcher game is like, people actually act in a human way. Like, nobody's really heroes or villains, which is kind of cool. Except, obviously, like, Gaunter. But, I don't know, I think people actually act in quite, like, a realistic way. It makes it quite nice, because cheesy heroics get really boring. A moment, Geralt. I will say to something. Oh. Then we'll chat. Doesn't he go, I need to smoke? Yank the herring out the barrel. Ah. So I'm guessing that's not a hurry. Come on, none of this dallying. Oh, oh, oh. No. Oh, I'm not playing Gwent, guys, because I used a pre-made oh, character, so I don't have my custom decks. So there's no point. You just get trashed oh, against uh, better decks. I've got the Good. default ones that you start with. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen, hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me, and don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, oh, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. Come with you. We must talk outside. Do a round for memes? I already have. I did one at the wedding against the doors. The theory believe one should only discuss important matters out of doors with the gods as witnesses. Beryl, what was that about? On the way here, we stopped for nourishment at a tavern belonging to one Lord Dauntless. We enjoyed ourselves as one does at an inn, raucously. Our antics were not to the liking of this dauntless. Sent a man to warn us that if we were ever to return, we would hang. You burned the inn down? I left ample compensation with the innkeep. But it seems the rapscallion neglected to mention this to his lord. But that's of little import. What matters is someone called me a horse and threatened to kill me. It was one of those threats that sound like an invitation. I intend to accept it. Return to those parts. I'm, I'm actually like, I'm I'm gonna like not threaten him because at the moment I've been doing sort of like every dialogue choice, but I actually kind of like Olgier, like sort of in a character way, I actually kind of sympathize with him, so I'm not gonna threaten him. Like the hopefully we can actually delicious. like get on with Olgier. Because I think he's pretty legit. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths, fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved. I'm gonna be legit. I like all yours. Yeah, I've loved. Can we get to the matter at hand? Perhaps instead, we ought to sit down inside. Have a good chat over some fiery water.
We'll drink once the job's done. Afraid that's impossible. Succeed and that's the end of me. Fail. <laughs> you'll not be back. The in the back I'm like, still waiting to hear it. What's going on? Why? Oh. Aren't you stubborn? Fine. Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that blue. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> when was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. You wished to hear a wish. Now you out. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this dormless, but one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you could tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you Godspeed, but, well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. Alright. Looks like we're off to find Iris. Nice little vomiting party going on there. Get ready for one of the best quests in gaming history. To be honest, that's applied to most of the quests I've done so far, so... <laughs> I mean, the, the Vladimir one was just hilarious. That's one of my favourite quests I've done in any RPG, I think. Jesus, that made me jump. Who the fuck was that? What? Anyone there? Oh, he's there. Mighty rusty and covered in creepers. Kendrick. Kendrick. You there? Not so loud. Ah! God, scared me off to... Not so loud, I said. Fog's not natural. Could be something in there hiding. Foglets or air nymphs, for example. Don't want to attract them. Believe me. F Foglets. Oh, sweet mother, my little. Why don't I ever come here? Kendrick fellow, who is he? I. We partners. Sneak into derelict houses. With something valuable lying about. Odd career for Kendrick. So thief. Thief steal from the living. What's the arm taking from the dead? Kendrick went to open the door. I stood watch. Suddenly heard his lamp smash. Then nothing. Quiet. Called out to him, but... There you go. Oh, shit. I recognize you. One of them foglets you spoke of. No. Is that the caretaker? Oh, that's the stone off my... I'll see what that was and look for your partner. You... I ain't about to wait around. I'm out of here. Pretty sprawling, this estate. Is the caretaker a man or a monster? I guess he's a monster. How am I gonna find that rose in this fog? That was totally the caretaker. That's not Resident Evil feeling on this show, isn't it? I suppose it's a good thing I'm a merchant, but you know. I'll look for something around here. Fresh manure. Does he like look after the manor now the family's gone or something? Come on, Hedge. Sorry. Water's ice cold. Mountain stream cold. Is that colder than ice cold? 
Rather worn. Used often. Wonder by who. Hang on. Talk. A grave here? Why do I feel like that dog's watching me? What are you doing in a place like this? Best shoe before you get hurt. Oh my dog. Okay. Interesting way to vault a hedge, but alright. I don't want to go up there. Probably not a bad idea. Beehives. Well maintained, but dormant. I don't mess with no bees. Caretakers, whatever. Bees, not the bees, mate. I'm good. Hello. An easel? It's an easel. Woods rotted completely. Looks like we don't have much choice. Here. Maybe somewhere out back. The lamp and the grounds trampled. Somebody dragged something this way. A body? Yeah. I'd scooch along, kitty. This place. What's that? That. Digging. A lockpick? Must have been the other thieves. I'm just gonna casually... I'm guessing if the caretaker jumps us, he's some sort of, like, undead or, like, demon or something, right? They so must have an oil for that. Versus humans and non-human. That seems pretty strong. I don't know what the caretaker is. He's just, like, an undead dude. Is he a cursed one? I, surely that's just really powerful. He's a non-human, right? He's a relic? Wouldn't that hangman's oil work, though? Non-humans means elves and dwarves? Ah, okay, cool. Hey, that, uh... Look at me, I'm a real witcher. I actually oiled my sword for once. Maybe I'll use a sign. Shit! Is this a stupid idea? I feel like this is probably a stupid idea. Alright, go on. God damn it. Bother him. Oh, it bothered him. It bothered him. Okay, it didn't bother him. He is nonplussed by my crossbow. Graves, unmarked, laid out in rows, like garden beds. Does he talk to us, or is he just like pure hey. rage? Hear me? Yeah, that's a good idea. Other 
a thief. Bodies mutilated. Who are you? Well, is his, was his foot like stitched back on? Oh no! Damn. Yeah, what the fuck? Well, at least he's blind. Just run. Oh, okay. Just like that, eh? I'm. I don't. I'm not that confident, boys. If I'm honest. Let's take a swallow. Oh, that's not how you take potions. So yeah. Oh, hit me. oh fuck! I couldn't. I didn't get like a dodge warning. Oh wow, he's slow as fuck. Okay, so basically we dodge him, and then he's, his spade gets stuck in the ground and we hit him, right? So we used to bait his attack out of him. Oh fuck, it just hits him. Does that heal him? Nah. Fuck him. He's... Okay, we dodged his initial attack, that's good. Oh wait, he didn't he didn't do the whole chain. Wait, did we go too far away, do you think? Yeah, it looks like he's gonna do the charge up now! Do the charge up, thank you! Fucking roll, thank you! What? Why can I hear other things? What? Let's just heal him? Oh, hello. Oh, do I need to kill those before they get to him? Are they healing him? Maybe there's a healing him. Roll, 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 roll. Why is your spade so glowy? Not a big fan of the glowy spade, if I'm honest. Get out of here, please. Yeah, I need to kill these fuckers before they get to him. They're healing him. Oh, fuck it. Bro, he's going nuts. So I need to like go super aggressive when he does the spirits. I can be quite aggressive against him, his attacks are fairly slow. That was stupid, that was stupid. Didn't really, I didn't recognize his attack pattern there. Can we kill him? Oh, fuck. I'm gonna go aggressive. I'm gonna go aggressive. Oh, I can't. What? Is he invin- Is he invincible while the sword blows? Uh, no, he's not. I'm just gonna try and rush him down. Fuck! He's got the techers, boys. God! Dude, you just need to go after his fucking spirits. Take away his spirits, he's got nothing. Shit, should've dodged that. Let's just wail on him, wail on him. Well, I feel like we can kill him now. What? That's so hard to dodge. Just do the charge up, do the charge up, do the charge up. Thank you. Got him. Whoa. Jeez. I do kind of regret not playing on a higher difficulty. I thought I'd be extremely bad, but like... I don't know. Fuck was that? That would have been fun if it was a bit harder. Like I got hit so many times there, I shouldn't have killed him so easy. Organs. Damn thing had no right to be alive. Well, philosophers do still debate what it means to be alive, exactly. Oh my goodness! Hello. 
Normally I'd be shocked, but not after what I just saw. Who are you two? Clearly not animals. Think of us as friends of the house. You two are a little mysterious. What's with the show? The pretense that you're animals. You couldn't have warned me? No. We're obliged to maintain discretion. So why talk to me at all? Why? Well, we get so few chances to talk to humans, and we're curious to know what brought you. Gonna need a better answer than that. Later. <laughs> That's exactly how I imagine the dog to sound. What about this thing? What can you tell me? Friend of yours? We called him the caretaker. Doesn't look like any creature I've ever seen. Where'd it come from? From very far away. He was summoned to guard Lady Iris and hey, the Twitch Prime He tended the garden, took care of unwanted guests. Very far away. Meaning where exactly? The name of this place would mean naught to you. Alright, rude. You know the master of the house, the owner? Olgird von Everick. Yes, we know him, but he left, and his wife became mistress of the house. Great. So, Lady von Everick home? Could you announce me, say she has a guest? Why do you wish to see her? I'm here to get the violet rose Olgir gave Iris just before he left. Iris is inside, in the bedchamber upstairs. Take his key, it opens the rear door. Guess I'll make my own introductions. So, how should I address you? As you did now. We'd rather keep our names to ourselves. Turn back. Ugh. Oh my god, this is dark in here. Yeah. Oh, that's to put my glasses on and off. Uh, oh, I need to unequip the sensor, I think. I say we turn back, boys. I say we had a nice run. Getting a bit spoopy. Oh, I didn't loot him, did I? I don't know if... <laughs> Where did he die? He died like around here, didn't he? Can I loot him? Oh, he just... Oh, he tell... I can't loot him. There's no loot. Does he not drop anything? Oh, okay. I have to take the spade. Oh my god. Secondary weapon. Let's go, boys. Perfect. Probably shouldn't ransack their house, I guess. Shit. Casual dumpling. What the hell was that? the bumpy camera, jeez. Why are the books? For oh, fuck's Be sake, do you, do you mind? Oh, 
<laughs> the camera is also haunted. <laughs> oh, not going up that way. So many spooky creeks. Alright, come on Iris, you babe, let's go. Mind. Hmm. Fire damage. Interesting. Does Olgier just habitually burn down every building he goes in? Because it certainly kind of seems that way. Side. Oh, it doesn't look like we can get up the other side. Oh, what's down here? Not meant to go down there. Eee! Only running. Okay. Uh, things I do for all gear, eh? Oh, good. What? I don't even fucking see. Oh, there she is. I need to put my like, cat potion on the side of the camera. Send me as the fucking camera. Oh, what's she doing now? Was that painting fucking healing her? Fucking move. Why is my camera like randomly? Okay, you can hit the paintings. So that's what my camera is locking onto. Okay. Painting's hitting it. Unlock, 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 unlock! Fucking. Oh my god. Whaler. Gosh, she's not white, is she? Tron, Tron, Tron. Fucking move, thank you. I'm actually just gonna whale on it. One. Which one? That one. No, it's not just the story. This is supposedly normal difficulty, but I agree. I am basically just tanking this boss, which is kind of weird. Oh, are you fucking serious? Oh my god, no, please swing. Thank you. Yeah, this is sword and story, but like, I'm not gonna lie, I did think some of the boss fights would be a, like, it just seems really hard to die. Like, I just face tanked that boss and went to like 80% health. I didn't think I'm over leveled or anything. Doesn't tell me he's on the floor here. Bed chamber. Iris was supposed to be here. Well, she is. She's right there. Gotta be here. Damn it. You wish to see her? Here she is. A man should frame his wishes carefully. It forestalls disappointment. The dog and the cat. I think they are going to be cards, actually. I think they were in the uh, audio. You didn't ask. 
And why hasn't anyone buried her? We can't. As for the caretaker, the one you cut down, while still alive, she ordered him to stay away from her for all time. How did she die? Don't see any wounds, evidence of a fight. Her heart burst. Meaning what? A heart attack? No, it simply burst. Find that hard to believe. Yet that's precisely what happened. One day Iris locked the front door, lay down here and died. From grief, from loneliness. Is... The deeper I get into this, the more I gotta wonder. Why are you even helping me? We were summoned to serve Iris von Everett. Yeah, I'm not changing difficulty in this playthrough, guys. But that did not free us from her service. Got it. You wanna leave this place, leave these bodies. <gasps> Surprised. No, not at all. Her ghost's restless, angry, attacks intruders. Know why? Lady Von Everick has endured much hardship. She's unaccustomed to guests and not fond of strange folk. She can't hear us. Seems I gotta speak to Iris's ghost. It's no easy task to contact the mistress. Rage and bitterness fill her. Got my ways. To make contact with Iris, I gotta bury her body. But that caretaker's macabre little cemetery won't do. Too much blood, too much fear. She spent much time in the front garden. Hmm, maybe there. Wait. Take this key. It opens the front door. Where is that dog Good keeping dog. the key? <laughs> It is once again extremely dark. Find a fitting spot to bury Iris. I don't remember where the uh, staircase was. Staircase this way? You look like a staircase. Oh. Wait, are we on the bottom floor again? That's weird. Oh, here we are. Okay, it put us back on the bottom floor. I was like, slightly lost there. Oh, hello. Oh, I was watching. All right. She liked to sit here, but this is not a good place for a grave. Too close to the house. I'll keep searching. And move wheel. Iris von Everek adored flowers. But she would never want to destroy them. Hmm. Alright, I'll dig the grave somewhere else. Good thing I've got my spade. This place seems suitable. Yes, she loved to paint. Did Iris von Everick have any last requests? Say how she wanted her remains disposed of? She feared death. Worried none would see to her burial or say a kind word in parting. Guess I'll be the one to do that. I've got a spade on my back. I need an additional spade. I can't say much about Iris von Everick, but I do know I like her paintings. It's a shame her art couldn't bring her greater comfort. At times, fate muddles our path, and life turns toilsome, hard to bear. Yet all deserve respite and peace in death. Respite. You too. Got any last words for your mistress? We don't partake in human rituals. Trusting that what you've done is in keeping with your customs. 
your name's inscribed in this sketchbook. Perhaps you'd like it to be buried with you. The remains are interred. Let's summon her. Tormented spirit, I've laid your bones to rest. Forget your wrath, forget your grief. Show yourself. Oh, God. Forgive me for tearing you from your realm. I need to ask you. The fuck? Should I follow you? Alright. Time for Dark Souls. Good Arundel.